Hello and welcome to another video. In this video, we're excited to bring you some important news regarding a new UK immigration rule that is set to take effect on April 12, 2023. Make sure to watch this video till the end to avoid missing out on important information, and don't forget to support our channel by sharing our videos on friends and family on social media platforms like Facebook, WhatsApp, and Twitter, so that we can continue to bring you the latest immigration updates. Under the UK's immigration regulations, individuals who have maintained a lawful residence for a period of 10 years are eligible to apply for indefinite leave to remain. This includes individuals who have been granted any type of permission to stay, regardless of whether it was temporary or under a long-term immigration route for settlement. The government acknowledges that all forms of lawful residence, regardless of their duration, demonstrate an individual's commitment to the country and warrant a chance at permanent settlement. Therefore, Anyone who has stayed in the country legally for 10 years can apply for indefinite leave to remain, regardless of the type of visa they were originally granted. Starting from April 12, 2023, individuals who hold temporary immigration status, such as those with short-term student visas, visitor visas, or temporary admission granted during the processing of their humanitarian protection or asylum application, will no longer be considered lawful residents. This exclusion will not apply to individuals who have already obtained lawful resident status prior to this date, nor will it impact individuals who have successfully applied for permanent residency. However, it is important for those affected by this change to consult with a qualified immigration attorney to understand their legal rights and options moving forward. It is important to note that there is a cut-off date for the implementation of new rules regarding applications. Any application submitted on or before April 12, 2023 will be processed according to the current rules, while any application submitted after April 12, 2023 will be subject to the new rules, regardless of the applicant's period of residence. Therefore, it is crucial to be aware of this timeline and ensure that all applications are submitted accordingly to avoid any confusion or delays. It is worth noting that this amendment will have significant implications for individuals who have been residing in the United Kingdom for 10 years and have not yet applied for an indefinite leave to remain. The modified regulation does not mandate that applicants must have lived continuously in the UK for the past 10 years up until the point of filing their application. Consequently, individuals who spent a decade in the UK as a child but then returned to their home country can still apply for indefinite leave to remain when they become adults, based on the time they previously spent in the UK. The upcoming changes in the qualifying period for visa applications, which will come into effect on April 12, 2023, may pose some challenges for applicants. The altered duration for the qualifying period of 10 years is expected to increase the level of scrutiny and consequently lead to longer processing times for applications. While this policy shift aims to enhance the screening process, some applicants may find the changes frustrating as it could result in delays in their application's decision-making process. Furthermore, Due to the nature of home offices, it can be difficult to establish a consistent and reliable timeline for processing applications. This lack of predictability can create additional obstacles when attempting to make informed decisions about application timelines, which can ultimately hinder the overall efficiency of the application process. In addition, delays in the application processing timeline can also create challenges in predicting a feasible timeline for subsequent steps. As the processing time drags on, it becomes increasingly difficult to estimate when the next phase will begin, causing further frustration and uncertainty for applicants. Thank you for tuning in to today's video update. If you found this information helpful, please consider liking, sharing, and subscribing to our channel to stay up to date with the latest developments.